Let's get to that breaking news out of Baltimore, Maryland, where right now crews are searching for survivors of that bridge collapse. So a container ship hit this bridge early this morning, and there's video of it actually happening. We're going to show it to you, but we want to warn you that some people might find it disturbing because, again, we know that vehicles were moving on this bridge when this bridge suddenly went crumbling down into the water. So take a look. You can see the container ship right there hitting a piling, and then the bridge goes down. There were multiple vehicles, as I mentioned, that plummeted into the frigid water. We just heard from authorities in the last hour as they continue to search for survivors. So let's show you where this is. We're talking about the iconic Francis Scott Key Bridge in Baltimore. It is one of the longest continuous truss bridge spans in the world. It's about 1.6 miles long. Let's take you some live pictures now where you can see the sun rising in the last hour over this massive scene. Crews have already rescued two people. One wasn't hurt. The other is in the hospital with serious injuries. Uh, we do know that the Baltimore fire chief says they are searching for at least seven people in the water, but that number could rise. Remember, this is all preliminary information that we're getting this morning. There are reports of a construction crew on the bridge when it collapsed. First responders, meanwhile, are using boats and helicopters to comb the surface and debris field. They have deployed drones and sonar to search underwater, and the fire chief confirmed there are cars down there. The bridge collapsed around 10.40 p.m. our time last night, and people living nearby described hearing it. And uh, we were awakened with uh, what appeared to be an earthquake and a, lo a long rolling uh, sound of thunder. Wow. So uh, we woke up and literally we can look right out of our bedroom window and see the key bridge. But I couldn't see anything because of the darkness. Now, we don't know exactly why this ship hit the bridge. We do know that it's sailing under a Singaporean, uh, Singaporean flag. It was leaving port, headed for Sri Lanka. Uh, we did hear the Baltimore mayor say that everybody on board this container ship is accounted for and okay. The story obviously is developing in real time right now, giving you another live look at this bridge, which you can see has crumbled into the water. That container ship's still there. We just heard from transportation officials in Maryland about 30 minutes ago. We're working on getting those details here at 530.